Hi there, and welcome to today's show. So you've seen us before as a new way to age, but today's show is a little bit different. We're going to be concentrating on the favorite people in our life, and that's the men in our life. And we at Medical Aesthetics, we do cater to men. I know a lot of people think that aesthetics and medical, usually women take advantage of all the services, but we do have many loyal male clients and we cater to a lot of men's needs. We want to make them feel happy and healthy and brand new. So we're sitting here today with Dr. Walter of Medical Aesthetics, the medical director, and we're here with George. So many of you know George, he works here at Acton TV, but he is also our men's club ambassador. Wow. So, George, you have a whole title now. I like us. having a title. Yeah, it's great. <laughs> so today we're going to just go through quickly some of the um, procedures that we have for men at, Acton, at uh, Medical Aesthetics. So the first thing we're going to concentrate on, because I know all of us love this, is the bioidentical hormone therapy. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to go to you first, George, because I know you've had great success with it. So if you could talk a little about it. You know, I first heard about it when you guys started producing their show. And I know you were saying that it gives you more energy. Um, it helps you with your workouts. You can lose weight. I'm like, well, who doesn't want that? Right. So I tried it. And immediately, I just felt like I had more energy. Um, especially, I've noticed, because I've been working out a lot. And I feel like the recovery time is a lot um, not so bad. I'm not so sore for like three days. Mm -hmm. And I know that when I went in, they had tested my labs. Dr. Gert tested my labs, and I was very low on testosterone. Mm -hmm. um, yep. You know, I'm 52 years old, and I know, you know, you know I'm no spring chicken. <laughs> so um, I know that with the hormones, it, it helped me boost my testosterone levels, which is great. I mean, I feel so much better. Uh -huh. So, And with that, you were saying um, that you've lost weight. I've you lost know. 20 pounds okay, since great. I've been on uh, the hormones. And it's not just that, though. I've been on a combination of, like, I've been trying to do a low-carb diet. Mm -hmm. I recently got married, so I said, I've got to, I've got to uh, lose 20 before I walk down, you know? Right, right. Which I did. I mm -hmm. achieved my goal. Good and you. now I'm up to, like, 22 pounds weight loss. I still think I have, like, 20 to go. But I, I really feel like the hormones have helped me. Great. So. Wonderful. So, Dr. Walter, just briefly... Just explain a little bit about the male therapy for bioidentical hormones. Yeah. So we, we use only bioidentical hormones. We do both female and male. And as you had said in the beginning of the show, that um, that this is more women kind of concentrated towards the, the aesthetic aspects of things um, and also with women's and men's health. But men are, are kind of learning about this and they're getting over their fear a little bit of this. Um, and w with the hormones specifically, we look at testosterone, we look at thyroid, uh, we measure some other hormone levels also. But um, And George, for instance, I think you did not need the thyroid because your thyroid level was was adequate, was, was doing well. But as you said, your testosterone level is really low. So it's very much individualized. Um, some people may need testosterone, some may not. Some may need estrogen for women. Um, but for the men specifically, as you had said, it obviously helps with the libido too. But with your workout, just some of the unexpected things of just being able to work out better and feeling better afterwards. Um, losing the weight is not everybody, but, right. but that can certainly happen. Um, joint aching and just the mental fog and the clarity, the kind of clarity of thinking um, usually really improves a lot. Um, so the, the other thing is we don't do, like you know, sometimes you see these guys are 80 years old and they look like Hulk Hogan. We're definitely not doing that. We don't do anabolic steroids or anything. It's just really giving you back what you had when you were younger. Okay. Um, and I think George is a good example of... of I, I think it's great. So, um, you know, like I said, I want to I get my husband to do them because he, he poops out, you yeah. know. Yeah, yeah. By he like Saturday tired. at midnight, <sighs> You know, so I'm like, you've got to get on the hormones. So we're taking him down too. So. Okay, great. I have his lab slip right here. <laughs> <laughs> well, Signing sure him right out. <laughs> That's funny. So I'm thinking about what you said about endurance and just feeling more virile. So we actually have another procedure at Medical Aesthetics, which is the P-Shot. And Dr. Walter, I always pronounce it, mis I don't say it right. So what is the real name of it? Not just the P-Shot. The Pryopishot. The, the, the P-Shot's easier. Shot. That's, okay. Okay. Um, so what the P-Shot is, is um, it's using PRP, platelet-rich plasma. It's basically taking your blood. So we're giving you concentrated, get out the platelets because they have growth factors that get the stem cells in for rejuvenation. It's your own. You're not getting somebody else's. You can't get infection from somebody else or um, or anything like that. And it's it helps with, uh, for women, it helps with urinary incontinence as well as libido. For men, it's really libido. Sometimes men get a difference in size, uh, but it's just really, things just work better and they feel better with it. Um, it's uh, And as most people know, erectile dysfunction and even 
uh, even if people don't have ED, men, sometimes it, things don't work quite as well, especially when they get older. So it's really the combination of the hormones and the PRP really works. The P-shot really works very nicely for, for most men. Okay. So. Okay. Well, that's great. So, so now, we con now we're going to concentrate, I think, more on the outward appearance. So yep. at Medical Aesthetics, we do Botox and fillers. Um, you know, we know women do the, them all the time, but it's really becoming a growing thing now for men to take care of their faces and, and to take care of fillers and Botox. And you've had some done as well, George? Yeah, I've had the fillers and the Botox. And I know that, you know, as you get older, you start getting like a lot of lines up here. Mm. I was kind of looking like cro Magna Man, you know. <laughs> So um, I, it just kind of smoothed me out a little bit, and it, I don't feel like it was too much because I've seen people um, who've had too much Botox, and it just, like, they look frozen so frozen. Face, and I yeah. felt like I still looked natural. No one could really tell. Maybe I just looked a little refreshed. As far as the fillers, too, like, it really, no one really, it wasn't really noticeable, but I can notice, like, you know, I'm a little more well, I, think, I think when you, <laughs> Well, I think when you say not noticeable, I don't think that's... My sense is it's not like, oh, my God, you had something done. You look like you have fish lips. It's right, more right. like, yeah, you look, something's different about you. You, you look like you've been sleeping well. Right, yeah, yeah. exactly. Right. Yeah, or you lost weight or something or yeah. had your hair done differently for yeah. some of us. <laughs> but, um, you look well-rested. That's, well rested. that's yeah, another one. Yeah. <laughs> and and just, you just look more youthful and you feel better, too. And mm -hmm. so we're one of the biggest Botox and filler providers in New England. And so I think there's a lot of people out there that do this. And they often do Botox by very cookie cutter. Like they'll say, you know, oh, you need this many units here, this many units here, because everybody gets that. And that's, I think, really kind of a beginner's way of doing it and not the right way of doing it, because it's really watching facial expressions, watching everybody has just different, maybe even asymmetry. Mm -hmm. um, so I think that's where the experience comes in, is trying to get the face more balanced and looking n very natural, because we, we really, New England's pretty conservative, so we really don't have many patients who want Right. You know, too much done and, and where it's really obvious. So, mm -hmm. you know, you look like Cher because they have huge cheeks. It's just kind of giving them back what they had before and maybe tweaking things a little bit. And right. my, my concern as a man is um, I know that women do want to lift when they get Botox. A lot of them want that lift right there. But on a guy, you don't want you don't want your eyebrows to look mm -hmm. who's You're, like carrot top. You know how we yeah. had yes, so much. Yes, it's yes. like so. Yes. I And what's great is um, we did the procedure, but you did a follow up appointment, which was like, um, like a consultation, it was yeah. on that you just because you wanted to see how it all just um, see if you need a little tweak settled. And I did need a little tweak, and you know so that's what I liked about it is most places you go in once and you're done. Like they never make a follow up a follow up appointment. So I, I felt comfortable because and even I had Tony do it. You mm -hmm. know my other half, he mm -hmm. even went back and did his follow up, and mm -hmm. um, I talked him in, and he's happy. He's coming back for it too. He was dead set against it. Now he wants to. Get oh it done. really? Oh that's yeah, so he's funny. Like, Whoa. You know? <laughs> <laughs> so that's what I liked about it, and with the fillers too. Like Stephanie had gone in and made sure everything was where it was. So mm -hmm. Great. We, have, we have three providers there every day, myself and two others, and and so it's you know we just it's not like some places will have one person come in a, when, once a week or right. something. Yeah, it's yeah. hard to get follow up, and, and we obviously don't do that. Right. So. And the good thing is, you know, the two week follow up or the whatever follow up is. Yeah, no if charge. You need, if you you need just, outside of that range, you're just so, making sure yeah, that which the no one is really happy. does that. No one really. They just send you on your way and you're done. So. Right. Great. Right. Good. Okay, so another thing too, um, we do medical micro peels, and you know that's pretty much explanatory. Yeah, I've had that done, and I've had the laser. I had these purple veins, mm -hmm. and I know we had zapped them off with it. We actually have a Facebook video of it, which we'll, we can show here. Um, so that really helped because I was looking at the beach one day. I was like on vacation. I'm looking at. I'm like, wow. These legs yeah. are those. <laughs> right. Not only am I white, you can see my veins. <laughs> I've got my grandfather's <laughs> legs. So we had zapped those off. And then um, it was really good. They're, they're really, you can't even tell, they're like really dilapidated. So. Right. So that's yeah. good. We have that's a lot right. of lasers. I mean, we, we, um, we do laser hair removal. We do the, the veins. We do skin rejuvenation. We have um, IPLs, which are a little bit different than lasers, and all addressing skin issues if there's discoloration. And most of it's really geared towards changing the aging process, a little bit improving things. Right. Um, right. And with me, I'm not trying to look like I'm 30. I'm just trying to look the best for my age. Because I see so many people my age that just who just have not taken care of themselves. And mm -hmm. I always tell people, everything you do in your 20s and your 30s, by the time you're 50, is going to catch up with you. Right. <laughs> you know, right. it's true. If you're smoking and you're drinking, you're laying in the sun, by the time you're my age, the party's over. <laughs> so... Right. You know. So speaking of another cool thing that we do is the cool lift, which I mm -hmm. know we've done videos with you on the cool lift, and it's great for men and women. And I really wish more men would take advantage of that. Especially if um, 
like I said, if you you know you're going to see your ex at a party, you know, get a cool lift done. You'd be like, hey, look at your missing out on. Um, it, it's really great because I had got married. We had done the procedure two days before, and you could just tell, like, we were just, our skin looked great, you know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's really nice. So. It's, it's uh, We have lasers that provide long-term wrinkle reduction and Botox and fillers can help with that too. What the cool lift is really, what's very nice is it's a quick fix and it lasts you mm -hmm. for a couple of weeks. So if you have it before a reunion or you have a wedding, we have a, I have a wedding coming up in two, three weeks. And I know my wife's had it done a few times. I'll have it done beforehand too. Um, and it's just, it's painless and it just, it's 20 minutes maybe. And you know, and really I think, nice, I think nice people's result. wives, like I think, you know, the wives need to bring their husbands down and just, right. you know, I think guys, some guys are very apprehensive, but you know, Girls, bring your husbands down and, you know, let them try it out. Especially you know? this one is very easy. It, there's no pressure by an implement on your skin, so it's not like it's hurting you in the least. Mm -hmm. So, you know, I know little guys are a little hesitant when it comes to pain. Right. Sorry, guys, but <laughs> <laughs> no, but this no is really no. painless. It's, it, you don't even know what's going on, really. Um, so another thing that um, we also do for skin, as we were just talking about, um, we have a skin medical line that mm -hmm. has just come out for men only. And I know mm -hmm. you've been on this as well. Mm -hmm. It's great. You've been using it. Yeah, I mean, I use the sunscreen, which I, I tell everybody, you know, sunscreen is like the, the fountain of youth, you know, but you have to start when you're like 25. Yeah. You have to put sunscreen on your face every day. And I usually, I get a lot of redness here. And since I've been using the Skin Medica, I have like slight rosacea right here. It's been gone. It's gone. Great. Right. So I've, I've noticed a difference, like, wow, I'm not all blotchy anymore. Mm -hmm. um, a lot of stuff you buy in the grocery store has, like, plastic in it, and who knows yeah, what they is, put. This is a physician-grade line. It's really, they, they do a very nice job. It's actually the Botox company owns Skin Medica, and this they just introduced, and it has a, um, a hydrator in it, like, it's like right, a super right. moisturizer. Yep. So after the, the shower, I'll put a little bit of that, and then I'll use the sunscreen. Cleanser, and, and then, yep. yeah. Yeah. yeah, it just comes in a nice kit. You can even take it traveling, but it's just, it's just men, you know, if they're not used to this, it's, sometimes it's hard to get them to do things, but it's, the instructions are in there, just one, two, three, four, and you use them, it tells you how to use them different times of the day and, you know, morning and night or both or whatever, and it just, it's, it's, even if you don't read the instructions, still pretty easy. <laughs> I say to guys, at least, at least get the sunscreen. Right. At least put sunscreen on you. If you don't feel like putting like four different things, at least do the sunscreen. Yeah, you, you, know? you have to do something. And that's very smart of Skin Medica to come, Medica to come out with this men's line. Yeah. It re was really needed. It shouldn't just be all about the women's skin. And it's not really, it's not, doesn't smell like it doesn't have like a perfume, perfume smell right. to it. Yeah. It's like very, you it's know, not offensive and easy. Not yeah. Yep. I love it. It's a great line. Great. So. Good, good. I'm glad, I'm glad you're the ambassador, George. You know so hey. much about this stuff. <laughs> <laughs> so we also do at Medical Aesthetics teeth whitening. Um, very easy procedure. Yeah. You can just explain a little bit about that, Dr. Yeah, Walton. it's a special product that we, we put in, and, and there's like a, um, a, um, a guide that where it goes into and it goes in, uh, into the mouth. And usually uh, there's three, four stages of lightning that happen, and you can have it done several times. Um, sometimes people have it done over two days just because we don't want to get started having the teeth hurt a little bit. Um, and it's, so it's a, nice, it's a nice way of just kind of doing a, actually a longer-term fix rather than just a quick few-day touch-up. Mm -hmm. so mm -hmm. It lasts for a while. Mm -hmm. All right. And so getting back to weight, and you were saying that you lost some weight. So there's two procedures that are at Medical Aesthetics, and it's Smart Lipo is one of them. Mm -hmm. And then there's also the HCG diet. Sure. So if you can just explain a little bit for the guys and how it would be advantageous for them. Yeah, the, the, so the HCG diet is both for men and women. Um, it's a, the HCG is a, it's, it's a very low dose hormone that we use and, um, and it just helps to kind of make hunger not that much of an issue. It's a very, it's a very strict regimented diet over 40 days and most people lose 20 to 25 pounds and we've lost, we've had people, you know, tons of weight over, over the years and been very successful with it. Um, all of this is online and we have different videos of different procedures. So this is kind of an introduction for, for all of them, but, right. um, but the HCG it's with injections and I, there's a video online how to do that. And I actually spend time teaching people because some people are scared of, of doing that and make it very simple, very basic. Sick, and so it's really also painless. Mm -hmm. um, the other procedure, the smart lipo, is actually a surgical procedure, procedure that I do, and I both use it's um, laser assisted and ultrasound assisted liposuction. Um, it's a day, it's, it's a procedure that takes a few hours. You just kind of lay there, you're sort of sedated but awake during the procedure, and you can be chatting or you can be sleeping or whatever. Um, and it's, it's, it has a very high success rate, and really is a, again, you can see the pictures online about how, how it works. And, 
I, I know no matter how much I work out, I still have love handles. Mm -hmm. Like I work out four times a week and I still have, you know, I would love to get rid of these. So yeah, everybody we'll has, <laughs> everybody has their spot, you yeah. know, the spot where the weight goes and just no matter what you do, you can't get rid of it. I know. So smart lipo would be a great option for, yeah. for that type yeah. of thing. Minimally invasive surgical procedure. Mm -hmm. Nice. And so lastly, in closing, we do have another procedure and men, when they get older, they tend to lose their hair a little bit. No offense, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> well, grass doesn't grow on a busy street, does it? That's right. <laughs> <laughs> so we actually have a procedure um, for that, and it's PRP. So you can yeah. s explain Clint, what yeah. the PRP part of it is. Yeah, yeah but what, like, could it work on someone like me, or I'm too far gone? I'm too, too far gone. Yeah, too far so gone. So it's <laughs> gonna, folks, gonna. Yeah. And mine, I'm pretty far gone, too, so <laughs> I wish I'd started, you know, 10 years ago or something. But, again, it's platelet-rich plasma. It's taking your own blood and... and um, takes, concentrating the platelets, um, and it helps to have the hair follicles, you know, helps them to grow. It's kind of putting fertilizer on the grass, and you got to have some grass there to okay. yeah. fertilize. <laughs> um, but it's, it's uh, for men, it's often, it's sort of once a month for two or three procedures, and then maybe once a year to maintain it. Okay. Uh, and it's gained a lot of popularity. It's been around for, for over 20 years. Um, initially, veterinarians used it, and the orthopedic docs use it for joints and to kind of help to rejuvenate the joints. Um, we use it now in faces, we do it in hair, we can do breast enhancement. The, the O shot is for females, the P shot we talked about before is for males. Um, so, and it's a quick office procedure and, and have a good, nice success rate with it if you're not too far gone. Right, right. So you have to have something up, up to go. <laughs> <laughs> and as you said, the, for the pain, you also do the, that procedure for pain as well. For, for, yeah, for the, the joints. For yeah. the joints, yeah. 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 And it can do wrists and shoulders and knees and yeah, mm -hmm. different places there. Mm -hmm. um, I think this has been a great show going over all the topics that we had needed to go over and show men and women, get your husbands to make an appointment. <laughs> uh, it, they really will thank you for it. They might kick and scream going in, but they'll love it. It's true because they will kick and scream going in, but once they see the results, they're going to go back. Because I know Tony was like, kicking and screaming. He did not want to go. I made him go before the wedding. So now that he, now that he went, he's coming back. So, <laughs> Right, right. So what, you just got to put your toe in the water right. and start. And then you're going to want to do everything. Absolutely. <laughs> so thank you, and Just George. a reminder, too. We don't charge for consults. So That's right, that's, right. So yeah. just come in, find out about it. We'll right. try to let you know the science behind it and show some pictures and before and afters. And if you have any questions, have that opportunity to ask a question. Perfect. And our and, um, the phone number and the contact information is coming in a second. Yeah. Right on the screen. Great. It's right on the screen. We'll yep. put it on the screen. Great. All right. Well, thank you, George, so much. Thank you for being our ambassador as thank well. You. Thank My you, pleasure. Dr. Walter. Thank you, Acton TV. And we'll see you the next time. Thanks a lot.